Hi, my name is Ramin Nazer. I'm from Brown Rakistan. Please form a positive opinion about me immediately. I hope you enjoy the five to seven minutes of human entertainment I've prepared for you. I've been practicing public speaking for a long time. Uh, I first tried it in 2007 at Cap City. I'd watched two open mics before, then I was drunkenly put up on the third night. I wasn't planning on going up that night, and then Sean, who's another comic, who's also the bartender there at the time, uh, got me a spot at the very end, and I went up, and it was, it was, it didn't just suck, 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 but it sucked. Isn't it strange that the same year that you start masturbating is the same year that the monster stops showing up under the bed? <laughs> Some people like to sit down and write. I hate that. I think it's very stale, and I can tell when a joke is written like that, when someone has sat down and thought of all the angles to look at this, and they have the tags written out. It's like, you prepared this. That's not, it doesn't feel like it was grown naturally. Not that my stuff is super great or anything, but I like to think that it's not, uh, it's not trite. It's not a masturbation joke, but you gotta talk about your life. Talk about, make eye contact, talk about your life. Be open, have comfort on stage. Move around a little. Take some pauses. I hope this doesn't sound too racist, but I could probably eat Chinese food like every day, niggas. <laughs> I've told that joke many times in front of primarily black audiences and the response has consistently been... I have RamonNazer.com, I have Ramon.com spelled R-A-M-O-A-N, I have HateSelf.org, I have PeterNazer.com. I bought Peter Nazer because some guy messaged me saying the title of the message was Peter, could you please send us your availabilities for uh, the month of <laughs> September, and I was wondering if it was a form letter or if he meant to send it to someone else, and I just replied, uh, yeah, I'm available all weeks except for these two, and I signed it Peter, and then still nothing, he still just said like, okay, thanks, didn't say like, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call you Peter or anything like that, and it was a Facebook of all things, so he sees my name and my face next to it and still calls it the Peter, so I'm like, I'm gonna still get Peter and answer it, so if he contacts me again, I'll send it to him, so I just made a quick website of that. I'm also working on these cartoons right now. Mr. Al, how many DWIs does it take to become a convicted felon without parole? So another thing I'd like to plug is the show I do every Friday at this theater called Cold Town Theater. The show is called Live at Cold Town. It's only five dollars. 10 p.m. every Friday. Plug it in, plug it in, plug it in. Thanks for watching everyone. Good night. Enjoy the rest of the comedy. Matt Berline! <laughs>